Hi, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will replace the non-ECC RAM model with the ECC RAM on the Dell Precision T3630. Here is the PC specs. As you can see, this PC has an Intel Xeon CPU installed, so I want to take full advantage of the Intel Xeon by installing ECC RAM to ensure stability and accuracy in Xeon-based systems. Today I received the RAM module from my order, so now let's open the box. Here are the two modules, Hynix DDR48GB, bus speed 2666 megahertz ECC UDIM workstation RAM and unbuffered server memory that I've just received from my order from AliExpress today. You may find more details about the Dell Precision T3630 memory support from the Dell support website in the video description. Here is my Dell Precision T3630. I use this PC for video gameplay capture purposes. I installed an Elgato 4K60 Pro Mark II to record the gameplay in 4K60 frames per second HDR. I usually turn this PC on all day, so I upgraded the ECC RAM to improve the system's stability. Replacing the RAM module on the Dell Precision T3630 is quite easy and does not require any tool. Now let's remove the non-ECC RAM module from the system. These two RAM modules are also 8GB each, which is 16GB. These RAMs are also great for general use, primarily gaming, so I will keep them for upgrading to another PC. Here, I compared the non-ECC RAM module with the ECC RAM module. The ECC RAM usually has one extra memory bank on the RAM module. Now let's install the ECC RAM module to the motherboard. Now it's done, let's reassemble the case. Now the PC is turned on. Let's check and verify the ECC RAM I have installed in the system. I searched on Google and found a website showing me how to check the ECC or non-ECC RAM on a Windows PC via command prompt. Now let me follow the guide. Copy and paste the command line and paste it into CMD. Here is the result. As you can see, the RAM installed is ECC. Now let's check the type of ECC of the RAM module. As you can see, the returned value from the command line will define the type of RAM. Now I'll try the command and let's see the result. The return value is number 5, which refers to ECC single-bit RAM. So it's correct because this PC supports ECC UDIM unbuffered unregistered memory module, which is why it is single bit ECC RAM. 
That's all I want to share with you today. If you like my video, please subscribe. Thank you for watching.